last time on Undertale. Actually, we'll, we'll see how I do. Probably not well. And now, back to our show. Oh yes, there you are, darling. It's time to have our little showdown. It's time to finally stop the malfunctioning robot. Not malfunction reprogramming it real. This was all just a big show. An act. Elphus has been playing you for a fool the whole time. She she watched you on the screen. She grew attached to your adventure. She desperately wanted to be part of it. So she decided to insert herself into your story. She reactivated puzzles. She disabled elevators. She enlisted me to torment you. All so she could save you from dangers that didn't exist. All so she you would think she was the great person that she's not. And now it's time for her finest hour. At this very moment, Elvis is waiting outside the room. During our battle, she will interrupt. She will pretend to deactivate me, saying, saving you one final time. Finally, she'll be the heroine of your adventure. You'll regard her so highly, she'll even be able to convince you not to leave. Or not. You see, I've had enough of this predictable charade. I have no desire to harm humans, far from it, actually. My only desire is to entertain. After all, the audience deserves a good show, don't they? And what's a good show without a plot twist? Hey, what's going on? The, the door just locked itself. Sorry, folks, the old program's been cancelled. But we've got a finale that will drive you wild. Real drama, real action, real bloodshed on our new show, Attack of the Killer Robots. We're just gonna spare. Yes, I was the one that rearranged the core. I was the one that hired everyone to kill you. That, however, was a short-sighted plan. You know what would be a hundred times better? Killing you myself. That worthless pea shooter won't do work on me, don't we? Don't you understand what acting is? This is probably what she'll do if things continue in this matter. Listen, darling, I've seen you fighting. You're weak. If you continue forward, Asgore will take your soul, and with your soul, Asgore will destroy humanity. Metaton. But if I get your soul, I can stop Asgore's plan. I can save humanity from destruction. Then using your soul, I'll cross through the barrier and become the star I've always dreamed of being. Hundreds, thousands, no millions of humans will watch me. Oops, I forgot that it explodes all the way. Let's glamour, I finally have it all. So what if a few people have to die? That's show business, baby. Uh, uh, I can't see what's going on in there, but... D don't give up, okay? There's one last way to beat Meta Time. It's, um, it's. This is a work in progress, so don't judge it too hard. But you know how Meta Time always faces forward? That's because there's a switch on his backside, so if you can turn him around and, um, and, um, press the switch, he'll be, um, he'll be vulnerable. Well, oh well, you gotta go. Seems like a good time to turn Meta Time around. Turn. Tell Metaton that there's a mirror behind him. Oh, a mirror? Oh, right. I have the look. I have to look perfect for my grand finale. Hmm. I don't see it. Where is it? Did you? Just flip my switch. Oh yes. I love that so much. <laughs> Metaton's one of my fa- oh god, I love him so much. Oh my! If you flip my switch, that can only mean one thing. You are desperate for the premiere of my new body. How rude! Lucky for you, I've been aching to show this off for a long time. 
so, as thanks, I'll give you a handsome reward. I'll make your last living moments absolutely beautiful. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. You'll turn. You turn and scoff at the audience. They're rooting for your destruction this turn. Lights, camera, action. Oh. Oh god. I'm not paying attention. Oh my gosh. Uh. Master Blue. Drama, romance, bloodshed. Metaton. Uh turn to pose. You pose dramatically in the audience box. I'm the idol, everyone craves. Okay. <laughs> I'm really bad at that. Oh my goodness. Um Heel turn. You say you aren't going to get ahead at all, for to reason three during this turn. Hey, time to set up world pop quiz. I have a bunch of keyboard, and this one's an easy question. Um, okay. Really, the hottest boss in all the land, and the coolest of all the... Nice detail, you're right. I do look quite nice. Boast. So you're not gonna hit at all. They're gonna gradually increase. Yours, they really showed everyone your heart. Why don't I show you mine? I'm just warming up. Oop. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. But how are you on a low dance floor? Ah. What it was. My bad. Alright, try and do this. Can you keep up? Well, at least I know what I'm doing now. I'll be back in a minute. Not just stay determined, blah blah blah. It's because I was pressing the wrong button. Really lucky that it missed that one time. Thank you. 
But I think we already know who's going to win. Witness the true power of humanity's star. Star, can you really protect humanity? Look at these ratings. This is the most viewers I've ever had. We've reached the Conklin milestone. One lucky viewer will have the chance to talk to me before I leave the underground forever. Let's see who calls in first. Hi, you're on TV. What do you have to say on this, our last show? Oh, hi, Metaton. I really liked watching your show. My life is pretty boring, but seeing you on the stream brought excitement to my life, vicariously. I can't tell, but I guess this is the last episode. I'll miss you, Metaton. Oh, I didn't mean to talk for so long. Oh. No, wait! Wait, look! They already hung up. I'll take another caller. Metaton, your show made us so happy. Metaton, I don't know what I'll do what watch without you. Metaton, there's a metaton shaped hole in my metaton shaped heart. Ah, uh, I I see. Everyone, thank you so much. And darling, perhaps it might be better if I stay here for a while. Humans already have stars and idols, but monsters they only have me. If I left the underground would lose its spark, I'd leave an aching void that can never be filled, so I think I'll have to delay my big abuse. Besides, you've proven to be very strong. Perhaps even strong enough to get past, past that score. I'm sure you'll be able to protect humanity. <laughs> it's all for the best anyway. The truth is, this form's energy consumption is... Insufficient. In a few moments, I'll run out of battery power and, well, I'll be all right. Knock 'em dead, darling. And everyone, thank you. You've been a great audience. Bye bye. Oh boy. I'm sorry I got so quiet at the end. I'm just, I, I just need to concentrate. <laughs> I managed to open the lock. Are you two? Oh my God. Metaton! Metaton, are you... Oh, thank god. It's just the batteries. Metaton, if you were gone, I would've... I would've... I mean, hey, it's no problem, you know? He's just a robot. If you messed it up, I could always... just build another. Why don't you go on ahead? Out of batteries. Keys out of batteries. Come on. S sorry about that. But let's keep going. So you're about to have me ask or huh. -huh. You must be you, you must be pretty excited about all that, huh? You'll finally, you'll finally get to go home. Ooh. 
wait. I mean, um, I, I was just going to, um, say goodbye, and I can't take this anymore. I, I lied to you. A human soul isn't strong enough to cross the barrier alone. It takes at least a human soul and a monster soul. If you want to go home, you'll have to take his soul. You'll have to kill Asgore. I'm sorry. God, uh, office, like, every character in this game is just so memorable from, like, boss monsters to just, like, the random side characters that you run into. Like, I remember so many of them, and the only ones that I don't remember as distinctly are probably, like, Astigmatism, Final Frogget, and, um, Blims a lot, but, like, I still know their names so well, so it's, like, it's nuts. Oh, God. This, this ending, though. I know we're still gonna get the neutral ending, because I can't- I don't know if I can actually get to the last part. Um... Where's this one lead to again? The elevator is in use. God, this is also so pretty. Just like I know that this is this is new home, but I still remember like oh man, this next part, this next part's gonna hit. <laughs> the music at this part too. Oh no, my favorite songs from this game are Bone Trussle. Death by Glamour, Megalovania, and Undertale. It's a golden flower. It's a golden flower. Dusty toys. There's a heart-shaped locket inside the box. Will you take it? Yeah, I'm gonna take it. There's a worn dagger inside the box. Will you take it? No. Mm, what a comfortable bed. If you lay down here, you might not ever get up. It's a family photograph. Everyone is smiling. There are a lot of striped shirts in here. It's a twin-sized bed. It's a drawing of a golden flower. Under renovations. A long time ago, a human fell into the ruins. Injured by its fall, the human called out for help. You took the key and put it on your phone's keychain. Despite everything, it's still you. It's Osgore's journal. All the current pages say, It's a nice day today. I think is still almost wet. It's just a chair. It's a king size bed. It's a bureau. There's a Santa Claus outfit inside. Macaroni art of a flower. For King Dad. It's a clothes drawer. There are robes, button up shirts, and a pink hand knit sweater that says Mr. Dad Guy. It's a trophy. Number one nose nuzzle champs 98. Oh, wait. So this game came out in 2010, and that's from 98. I'm gonna say maybe Asriel might have been, no, not 2010, 2015. So it's possible that Asriel was probably about 17 years old, if not young, or if not older. Um, we don't know exactly when they had Asriel. So. God, I love the music for this area. I'm sorry I'm so glad I just enjoy this. Azriel, the king's son, heard the human's call. He brought the human back to the castle. This whole scene, like, it, it killed me the first time. Like, it's just, like, Undertale the song itself has... Switching from typical in-game music to actual instruments, like acoustic instruments, it 
it really hits that much harder, like how this is the end of the game, or at least it will be. Seems like gardening tools. There are photo albums, scrapbooks, books on how to make tea, and like, there are coals, the coals are still warm. It's a great reading chair, but it doesn't seem like anyone uses it. Over time, Azrael and the human became like siblings. The king and queen treated the human child as their own. The underground was full of hope. I like, oh gosh. The fridge is full of unopened containers of snails. There's some white fur stuck in the drain. He took the key. It's a note. Howdy. Help yourself to anything you want. Oh, that's not the voice that I'm going for. The stove top is very clean. Someone must use fire instead. It's a trash can. It's full of crumpled up recipes for butterscotch pie. <sighs> God dang it. <laughs> it's little things like that. Because it's like I know what happens. So. You unlock the chain. Mm -hmm. Then, one day. The human became very ill. The sick human had only one request, to see the flowers from their village. But there was nothing we could do. The next day. The next day. The human died. Azrael, racked with grief, absorbed the human soul. He transformed into a being with incredible power. With the human soul, Azrael crossed through the barrier. He carried the human's body into the sunset, back to the village of the humans. Azrael reached the center of the village. There, he found a bed of golden flowers. He carried the human onto it. Suddenly, screams rang out. The villagers saw Azrael holding the human's body. They thought he had killed the child. The humans attacked him with everything they had. He was struck with blow after blow. Azrael had the power to destroy them all. But Azrael did not fight back. Clutching the human, Azrael smiled and walked away. Wounded, Azrael stumbled home. He entered the castle and collapsed. His dust spread across the garden. The kingdom fell into despair. The kingdom, the king and queen, had lost two children in one night. The humans had once again taken everything from us. The king decided it was time to end our suffering. Every human who falls down here must die. With enough souls, we can shatter the barrier forever. It's not long now. King Asgore will let us go, give us hope, and save us all. You should be smiling, too. Aren't you excited? Aren't you happy? You're going to be free. I guess we'll go to here first. Oh, this is... Yeah, okay. We're gonna go here first and we're gonna finish up this next part. God, this... Ah, oh, the art for this. I love that the music stops right there.
Hey, Sans. So you finally made it. The end of your journey is at hand. In a few moments, we will meet the king. Together, we will determine the future of this world. That's then. Now, you will be judged. You will be judged for every action. You will be judged for every EXP you've earned. What's EXP? It's an acronym. It stands for Execution Points. A way of quantifying the pain you have inflicted on others. When you kill someone, your EXP increases. When you have enough EXP, your love increases. Love, too, is an acronym. It stands for Level of Violence. A way of measuring someone's capacity to hurt. The more you kill, the easier it becomes to distance yourself. The more you distance yourself, the less you will hurt. The more easily you can bring yourself to hurt others. But you? You never gained any love. Of course, that doesn't mean you're completely innocent or naive. Just that you kept a certain tenderness in your heart. No matter the struggles or hardships you faced, you strive to do the right thing. You refused to hurt anybody. And even when you ran away, you did it with a smile. You never gained love. But you gained love. Does that make sense? Maybe not. Now, you're about to face the greatest challenge of your entire journey. Your actions here will determine the fate of the entire world. If you refuse to fight, Asgore will take your soul and destroy humanity. But if you kill Asgore and go home, monsters will remain trapped underground. What will you do? Well, if I were you, I would have thrown in the towel by now. But you didn't get this far by giving up, did you? That's right. You have something called determination. So, as long as you hold on, so as long as you do what's in your heart, I believe you can do the right thing. Alright, we're all counting on you, kid. Good luck. Ah, <laughs> my keyboard got stuck. I'm gonna do a thing really quick because um, we're gonna get some secrets real quick. So hopefully this isn't going to mess up my game. Oh my god, it's at <laughs> now we're in 37 seconds. Oh my goodness. Wait a second. The look on your face while I was talking. You already heard my spiel, haven't you? I suspected something like this. You're always acting like you know what's going to happen. Like you've seen it all before. So, I have a request for you. I kind of have a secret code word that only I know. So I know if someone tells it to me. We'll have to be a time traveler. Crazy, right? Anyway, here it is. Whisper, whisper. I'm counting on you to come back here and tell me that. See you later. Alright, let's do it. So you finally made it. Huh? Do you have something to say to me? What? A code word? Can't you speak a little louder? Did you? Just say, I'm a stupid doo doo butt? Wow, I can't believe you would say that. Not only is that completely infantile, but it's also my secret code word. That, however, isn't good enough. What you need is the secret secret code word. It's only for people that know the secret code word. Anyway, here it is. I'm counting on you to come back here and tell me that. See you later. I'm back. Hi, Sans. So you finally made it. Huh? Do you have something to say to me? What? The code word? Can you speak a little louder? Did you? Just say, I'm the legendary fort master? Wow. That's, uh, really childish. Why would you think that was a secret secret code word? Whoever told you that is a dirty liar. I don't have a secret secret code word. However, I do have a secret secret triple secret code word, which you just said. So, I guess you're qualified. Here's the key to my room. It's time. You learned the truth. When you looked, the key was already on your keychain. Alright, so I'm gonna face off against Asgore. I'm probably gonna die. That's okay. Um... Yeah. Wait, hold up. What? What? Okay. Trust me, it makes sense. Throne room. Let's go. 
This is upsetting though. He's a really sweet guy. But he has done legit like he's just killed people. Dum de dum. Oh, is someone there? Just a moment. I have almost finished watering these flowers. I'm sorry, I hold up. Did you just summon a bunch of monsters in one turn? Isn't that against me? I'm not gonna lie, the only- <laughs> my ideal version of this would be to use the uh, little Karibos Yami voice, but it's gonna be difficult. Here we are! I can't be as goofy as Sans, but he has- howdy, how can I- Oh. I so badly want to say, would you like a cup of tea? But, you know how it is. Nice day today, huh? Birds are singing, flowers are blooming, perfect weather for a game of catch. Oh, that is so upsetting. Good golly. You know what we must do. When you are ready, come into the next room. Gonna do my best. How tense. Just think of it like a visit to the dentist. Are you ready? If you are not, I understand. I am not ready either. Also, I just like this, this, this hallway. Like how he made it look is so cool. This is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped underground. If, if by chance you have any unfinished business, please do what you must. Can I continue? I see. This is it, then. Ready. The light fills, the strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems your journey is finally over. You're filled with determination. Human, it was nice to meet you. Goodbye. Gosh, I love- oh god. Okay, pixel art is crazy because like, especially in this game, there's just like little amounts that are moving in, like, just that. And actually, like, thinking about it, how many- how many kids that- how- how much does Asgore- or how many kids did he kill before, like, he had to destroy the mercy button? How did he recognize it? Like, I don't. It's crazy. Oh jeez, oh jeez. Okay, 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 okay. That's not bad, that's not bad. Oh jeez, oh gosh. Oh boy. That's a critical hit. Oh god. Okay. I know how to fight him, I, or I have to fight him, but uh, 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 okay. I'm doing way better than I thought I would. How am I okay? I I I wasn't. I'm not. Oh 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 jeez. 
okay. I was against about that. It's okay. I just want to see how well I did. But I'm gonna go do a couple of little things. So, uh, fast forward time. There is an elevator somewhere around here. I can't remember where, though. <laughs> no. go get some food then probably go to Tem Village get some things um, although I was doing pretty well for like I saw Lee didn't have to heal for the first half of that so I might actually be okay but I am going to have to get some Healy Hoos because if I don't I'm gonna or not Healy Hoos but uh get some things for uh, armor and stuff like that. The Temi armor. Oh wait, it's gonna have to take the elevator. I think it's right floor one. It's either that or left floor one. Can't remember. No. Left floor one. Me 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 Tra la la, tra li li, tra li li. It has been a while since I've been here. Come again sometime, tra la la. Do 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 do. Hey, punk! What's up? Achoo! Iris, how can you stand this cold? I have no skin. So why don't we just stand in Grillby's instead? Because I hate grease. But you don't have a stomach. No, but I have standards. Oh, hey. You're leaving soon, right? Don't come here to say goodbye. Goodbyes aren't allowed in my town. Just see you later. Don't say goodbye. I hate goodbyes. Man, that is an old thing. What? Oh. I was like, wait, no, I know I did the thing. I know I did the thing. Do, 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 do. Oh, wait, you know what I never did? I got 20G. How much gold do I have? I have 400 days, and that's not too bad. You unlock the door and enter. Running, 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 running. Uh, actually, you know what? Ring, ring. There is no response. Okay, well, Sans. Running, 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 
running, running. <laughs> hey, Sans, uh, have you seen my- Oh, hello! You aren't Sans. Wait a second. Why were you using a treadmill in the dark? Is Sans bringing you across time and space? I hate it when he does that. How immature can you get? Also, have you seen my action figures? Wait, I know where to look. In my collection. <laughs> Sometimes I'm a genius. All the time. It's a treadmill. There's a message attached. The truth is that you got owned, nerd. It appears to be a self-sustaining tornado made of trash. It's a worn mattress. The sheets are bunched up in a weird, creasy ball. It's Sansa's dirty sock pile. Scandalous? Inside the drawer is a silver key. You put it on your keychain. It's a thank you letter. It's addressed to Santa. It's an uncovered pillow. <laughs> Sans, the virus. Sans stuff. You unlocked the door and entered. Oh! There's a photo album inside the drawer. There are photos of Sans with a lot of people you don't recognize. It looks happy. You look in the drawer. There's some kind of badge. Blueprints? You can't read any of the symbols they're written in. Or maybe it's just the handwriting. Looks like they relate to some kind of strange machine. Blueprints. You can't read the symbols. Oh. There's a strange machine behind the curtain. It seems to be broken. Wait, where's- I know. There's a photo. Wasn't there- There was- did they- did Toby change it? I think I remember reading that. Um, originally he had like a thing in here that says, um, don't forget. Huh. I like how it's also the song gets raining somewhere else. Oop. How? What? <laughs> okay. Okay, now we gotta go to Underfall. Underfall? No, Underfall is a thing too, but I'm not going to that land. That is a bad time. Um, underwater. Under... Waterfall. Waterfall. That's where I need to go. God dang it, I'm so great at this. I might have to cut this off and then do the Asgore versus... Me fight. -la -la. Uh -oh. For the sake of everyone, I'm cutting it off here because all I do is go to Waterfall and run back and forth. So, with that, thanks for watching, thanks for listening, and I hope you catch you next time. Subscribe, by the way, or comment. And please, just at least watch the first like three seconds of this video. That beginning part put too much effort into it. Okay, thanks, bye.